I was 12 years old when I first got locked up and I felt like a panda in a lion's den. I was really uncomfortable and I didn't understand what was going on. The first time I got locked up was when I was 13 years old. I felt pretty alone. I felt sad, I felt anger. I was, I was just hurt. I was a, a, a child, a hurt child. I, did, I didn't know how to act, I, I didn't know how, how to feel. I used to get locked up for running away from home when I was 14, and that's when um, not only I found out that I was gonna be doing a lot of time, I also found out that I was pregnant, um, which is very scary because I was, I was, still, like, I was still a kid. What stirred my heart was um, my daughter's uh, journey with her drug addiction. As I was at church one day and, and, and heard the guest pastor speak about, you know, looking for volunteers to do a Bible study for youth in lockup is kind of when the light bulb start to go off. Growing up, I had a group of friends that several of them actually ended up in lockup. When my pastor approached me about the opportunity to go into the facilities, I had an immediate yes. Absolutely yes, and I think my yes came from a desire to really be to others what I didn't have in that season of my life. He was the only guy who came to, to, to actually ask me what's going on. Every time he came, I used to go to the Bible study because that was my friend. Now I trust him. Now I feel like I got somebody, you know, somebody I could talk to, somebody I can express myself to. And when they came, they told they they told you what they saw. And even if you didn't understand, they would give you time to fully see yourself the way they saw you, the way God sees you. They're very honest, and I appreciate that so much because it gives me the liberty also to be honest and be transparent. And through that, there's a connection and a bond that's formed. It's been exhilarating and, ins and inspiring, and it's made me a better person. And I'm supposed to help make the young men better, but I think they're doing it for me.